Welcome back to The Cigar Guys. My name is Alex, and today I'm going to be talking about the top five cigars for beginners, at least in my opinion. We make videos on this all the time on social media like TikTok and YouTube Shorts and Instagram, but I wanted to make a long-form video for you guys, and I'm sure you're going to see a lot more of these videos because it's very hard to pick a top five, especially for cigars that are good for beginners because there's so many. But right now, we'll just talk about my current top five. You'll probably get an update list at least once a year. I mean, uh, opinions change all the time. But I'm chilling with my dog, Vader. So he's going to just sit here and listen to me yap for a few minutes. First things first, let's talk about the cigar that I'm smoking, which is a great cigar for beginners. This is a boutique cigar brand. It's much smaller than a lot of the mainstream brands out there. But this is the Besa Cigar by 1102 Cigars. It is a great smoke for beginners because it is more on the mild body side. It is a very smooth smoke, very easy on the draw, a lot of smoke output. The construction is good. Very, very good, I should say. Uh, it's got a... Ecuadorian Habano wrapper, don't let the color fool you though, because just because a cigar is darker doesn't mean it's stronger. A lot of people think that uh, the color ultimately determines the strength of the cigar, and that's not always the case. But this Ecuadorian Habano wrapper is rich in flavor, so it's easy for new smokers to pick up the flavor notes and the nuances in this cigar while not getting too overwhelmed by the body. Some of the flavor notes would be including cedar and hazelnut. Towards the middle, it transitions into cocoa and espresso. And you get to enjoy a little bit of spice towards the end. But again, it's not going to be a harsh spice. It's not going to be overwhelming. This cigar all the way through is very, very smooth, uh, pretty light body. And uh, you find these at uh, a lot of brick and mortars in the Orlando, Florida area. But of course, you can get them online at BasisCigars.com or any of 1102 Cigars online retailers like CigarHustler.com or CigarChief.com. Those are the biggest online retailers. The second cigar on my list is going to be the My Father Connecticut. This is going to be on the cheaper side. They're retailing around 8 or $9. Uh, and they're smaller in size. So for a cigar smoker that doesn't want to smoke for very long, maybe it's one. maybe they want to keep it under an hour. This would be a great cigar for you because they have, for example, their Corona size, which is a much smaller size. You can knock that out in about 45 minutes. That way you're not feeling like you're wasting a cigar. Just in case you aren't enjoying your very first cigar, but I promise you this is a great cigar for the price. High quality, Connecticut wrapper with great flavor. You'll get notes of hay and some cedar as well. Um, and some, maybe some white pepper, those sweet spices. And the body is definitely going to be mild, so it's going to be a very smooth, enjoyable cigar. The draw is also great on this cigar. Uh, that's a great pick for beginners, too. My Father is more mainstream, so you can definitely find it at a lot of brick-and-mortar shops. And you can find it online pretty much at any retail cigar shop. My next one is going to be the Perdomo Champagne which is an even more mainstream brand that you can probably find at more brick and mortars and you can find it online. But the Perdomo Champagne is definitely a favorite amongst new cigar smokers. A lot of new cigar smokers are recommended this cigar. They end up enjoying the cigar. It's a Connecticut as well, aged 10 years. And it's kind of cool because it comes in this dark orangish yellow cellophane. So it's very easy to distinguish from the other cigars. You'll get notes similar to the My Father Connecticut. It's going to be cedar, some hay. Uh, it's going to be a little bit on the sweeter side, so you might enjoy that a little bit more. The size is going to be slightly bigger, so you're going into that hour plus mark, but it is such a smooth and enjoyable smoke. The next cigar on my list is going to be a more expensive one. So if you're a new cigar smoker and you got money like that, definitely check out this cigar. It's a very great experience for your first cigar. It is going to cost you, but it is a favorite amongst 
not only new cigar smokers, but even seasoned aficionados, they keep coming back to this one. And it is going to be the Davidoff Grand Cru. This is going to be a mild to medium cigar. For most people, it'll be more mild. Incredibly smooth, full of flavor. You're going to get more notes of, uh, you're going to get nutty, leathery flavor notes on this cigar. It's definitely going to be an elevated experience from the last two cigars that were mentioned. The Davidoff Grand Cru is just an excellent cigar in terms of quality and construction. It's going to be anywhere from the $20 to $30 price tag, depending on the size. There's plenty of different sizes for you to enjoy. But like I said, at that price tag, it's worth it for many, many cigar smokers. For my final pick, I'm going to go with the cheapest option today. It is the safest bet in terms of price if you don't want to spend a lot of money. But it is the Atoro Fuente Curly Head. The cigar retails at around $5. It's going to be a relatively quick smoke, probably 45 minutes, somewhere around there. Uh, for the price, absolutely great quality. Arturo Fuente makes very high quality cigars. And despite this being only $5, this is still very high quality. Very smooth, great draw. You're not going to pick up as many unique flavors. It's not as complex of a cigar. But for that price tag, it's definitely worth it. And you can find these cigars pretty much anywhere. They might go out of stock a little bit quicker just because of the price, but you can find them at any cigar retailer online, and most brick-and-mortar shops are going to have these. So that's my top five list for new cigar smokers to try, ranging from all different price points, all different flavor profiles. You guys can decide for yourself and pick which one you want to enjoy. If you like this video, if you found it helpful, be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you can stay updated with when we upload new content. We have full podcast episodes that we upload every week, YouTube shorts. We have a bunch of social media out there as well for you to check out. Everything's in the description, but go ahead and like this video, show your support. We appreciate you for tuning in. And until next time, see you later.